Hello, I am Snop Anybody, and this is part four of my uh, six photo odyssey. Today, I will be reviewing the coffee kick. But let's have a look at the snuff and see what it looks like. The snuff looks like this. It is dark reddish brown. The grind is medium. The moisture level is also medium. Uh, the snuff clumps up and kind of peels very easily and is quite easy to take. But let's see how this uh, snuff smells. Okay, so in the tin I can smell coffee. There's just a hint of menthol on it. And a tiny bit of uh, that good base tobacco. Yeah, that's basically it. But uh, let's have a pinch and see how it works in the nose. Okay. In the nose you get quite a lot more menthol than you do in the tin. Uh, but you also get uh, the pounding of good coffee scent. It is a very pleasant coffee. It is uh, dark, roasted, rich coffee. And there is also just a tiny hint of that very good base tobacco that we also find in the natural snuff. I do not perceive very much nicotine on this snuff, so on a scale from 1 to 10, where 1 is nothing and 10 is core nurse, uh, I am rating this a 3, maybe 4. I am not a very big fan of menthol in my coffee, uh, but this is a very good coffee, so... Uh, I am willing to overlook this. Um, so rated overall as a coffee snuff uh, on the squinty scale where one is an awful snuff and five is a heavenly snuff. I am going to be rating this three and a half, four. Yeah, something like that. Oh, it is a very pleasant snuff uh, and highly recommendable if you like menthol in your coffee. That's the end of part four for me. Uh, please check back for part five of my six photo odyssey. Goodbye.